Hello everybody, this is Matthew from iStrategy, an advanced quality manufacturer of 2G, 3G, 4G GPS tracker since 2015. Today we're going to show you how to connect our FID card reader to VT200L GPS tracker at your office before you can make an actual installation in your vehicle. Step 1 is about tools preparation. You need one computer, one cell phone with two SIM cards, one VT200L GPS tracker, you need one buzzer, you need one relay, you can use 12 voltage or 24 voltage, you need USB cable for online configurations, you need our FID card reader with ID card, and you need 12 voltage power supply. Step 2 is about online configurations. Thanks for choosing iStratec GPS Tracker. Let us guide you how to configure our 4G GPS Tracker VT200L and our 2G GPS Tracker VT200. After you receive samples, please contact iStratec to get password to download user menu and software from our official website. Please find the USB driver for computer with Windows system and install it. If your computer is using Mac or Vista system, please contact us for other USB driver and then install iStratec Parameter Editor and open it. Now please connect your GPS tracker to Parameter Editor by iStratec USB cable. And now you can choose the right COM port and click Open. Now let us switch on the GPS tracker and you see the two LED will be fixed. And here shows connected. Now let us click read all. So we can see the tracker information such as SN, IMEI, and firmware. Click GPRH. We can see it is support two GPRH servers. So we can set server IP port here. After we configure it, please click right to save all the configurations. If you want to enable GPRS SMS alarm, you can directly set in parameter editor. GPRS1 means server 1. GPRS2 means server 2. Authorized number 1, 2, and 3 are uh, for phone numbers to receive SMS alarms. And also you can enable GPRIS event to trigger output one and output two. For example, if you want to set authorized ID to control car ignition on and off, you can enable GPRIS event 53 right here and it's output one and after you make all the configurations please click right to save your configurations step three is about making wireless connection 
We use a Barza alarm to remind the relay status. You connect our FID to our S232 port from GPS tracker. There are two red wires and two black wires from our VT200L GPS tracker. So please find the right red wire and black wire for power supply. And you connect the red wire to 12 voltage and you connect the black wire to G and D. Yellow wire, which is output one from GPS tracker is to be connected to the yellow wire from relay. Relay white wire should be connected to 12 voltage power supply. As you can see, we have two green wires, 8, 7A and 30. The two wires should be connected to the power supply for fuel tank so that it can control the power supply for the fuel tank. The orange wire from GPS tracker, which is input 2, should be connected to ACC wire. If you want to use our FID card reader to control your car ignition power supply, then you shall set the SMS command. Firstly, we shall set the authorized ID number. So we use 144 SMS command to configure the ID number as the authorized one. You send this SMS command format to GPS tracker SIM card and the reply will be OK, means that it has been authorized. And then we use 212 SMS command to set the output to control the vehicle power supply by the authorized ID number. And you send this SMS command format and you get a reply, OK. Last step is about testing our RFID working principle. After the SMS configurations, we have to connect 12 voltage to our GPS tracker power wires and the buzzer will start alarming immediately to remind you that the wires connections have been done properly. After that, we shall connect 12 voltage to our orange wire, which is input two from GPS tracker. And the buzzer will stop alarming, meaning that ignition on. So in this way, you need to swipe the authorized card to recover the power supply. Now let us do some testing. Connect 12 voltage to the wires from GPS tracker. And you connect input two. Now you need to swipe the ID card to recover the power. It is our pleasure to have you in Isotech family. For more information, you may visit our official website www.istartech.com. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Shenzhen Istartech Technology Company Limited is an enterprise engaged in research, development, manufacturing, and sale of IoT products. Since its inception in 2015, iStartech has established strategic partnerships with a number of internationally renowned IT enterprises, 
with the capability of rapidly mastering and accessing global leading edge to make technological breakthroughs and facilitate product innovations. iStar Tech products, including 2G, 3G, 4G, MB, LoRa, GPS tracker, and 4G router, provision of services and products, integrating both hardware and software platforms, as well as customized specialty services, is one of our major competitive edges. With quality being its top priority, iStar Tech targets to offer IoT equipment with stable and enduring performances. Our mission, dedicated to provision of long-term stable running IoT devices. Our R&D team, iStar Tech engineers with six years industry experience, serving hundreds of clients worldwide. Our sales team consists of eight technical sales with rich experience in offering multi-language pre-sales and after-sales services. Our production capability with our partner factories, 15 high-speed SMT lines, and our assembly lines, ensuring monthly production of 40,000 pieces of quality trackers. Our quality control, 12 times of quality inspections, 36 hours aging testing, tracker qualified rate at high level of 99.5%. Our services, 2 days quick sample delivery, 6 hours fast technical response, 12 months warranty. We look forward to establishing long-term relationships. Achieve win-win cooperation. Quality GPS checker and 4G wireless router. Welcome to Wii!